great. Let's go ahead and get the meeting started. Thanks, everybody. Sorry for the hiccups. Uh, we'll call the meeting to order, make introductions, do the committee first. I'm Ron Terry, the chair of the exemptions committee. Um, Robin? Robin Kay on Lanai. Nobody else is in the room with me. Oh, yeah. Nobody's in the room with me. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, Maka'ala? Maka'ala Kaumuana. I'm on Kauai and I am alone. Okay. And Onauna? Onauna Thone. I'm in on Oahu and nobody is here with me. Thank you. Okay. And um, Les has kind of already said he's there and there's various people in the room helping him. I don't think we need to count them. Um, <clears throat> they're going in and out. And then we have Dominic, would you please introduce yourself? Uh, Dominic Diaz, Board of Water Supply, City and County of Honolulu. Okay. All right, thank you very much. Um, we're going to, um, we don't have any minutes today. I actually haven't prepared, but we're not gonna, we're not gonna go over and we'll do it at the next meeting because we wanted this one to be short um, so that we could accommodate our, um, our schedule. So we only have one item on the agenda. That's the Board of Water Supply, where uh, their, their list was published after the, our committee and the council decided to let it, let it out for public comment. Uh, during uh, the 15 minute, 15 minute comment period, that's good. 15 day uh, informal comment period. And at times after that, Oh, there's a little feedback there. I don't know why. Uh, the, the, there were no comments there on the no, list. Hey, uh, Les, you want to mute? Oh, sorry about that. Yeah, let me, I'll mute myself. Go ahead. Okay, thanks. I hope that'll take care of the little feedback there. Um, so, uh, committee members, have you got any questions or comments on the list? You've seen it before, but um, you know there's time if you have anything anything you'd like to say. I have just a couple of uh, minor cleanup items. So you know, thank you again, Dominic, for coming to see us, and I, I believe you folks made um, you know edits and whatnot based on our past discussions. I think just in terms of you know once the list goes to final on the very first page. Um, after Honolulu Board of Water Supply at the top, I think we can you know delete the semicolon. And then whoever finalizes the list will just have to add the, the concurrent state, right? Assuming that the, com the full council does concur. Um, but other than that, you know, thanks very much to Board of Water Supply for continuing this process with us. Okay, thanks. So now, now Dominic? Yeah, that's, I mean, we, I'm fine with that. Okay, we'll mention that at the meeting, yeah. Um, it takes an attorney to notice a semicolon out of place. I appreciate <laughs> that. <laughs> but uh, you're right. It doesn't make any sense. Um, good. We'll get it perfect. And uh, yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll want you to have the, the date of concurrence. And then, um, you know, but doesn't Les stamp that also, Onana? Yeah, I think so. You know, other agencies, and not to say it's a requirement, right? They usually put the date uh, updated, you know, for whatever year, so that I think you folks can kind of track it historically. So maybe that's something you want to do, Dominic, is just put, you know, updated April 5th, 2022, and then we'll, on our end, yeah, Les will probably do the stamp for the actual concurrence. Um, you know, I, I guess up to you folks if you want to have it or not. I, I tend to not really like documents that don't have dates on them because you look back at them five, 10 years later and you know have no idea where it came from, so. That's a very good point. Ron, I had a, I had a comment. Okay. Thank you for coming, Dominic, and thank you for this work. Um, I, um, just because of, of current experience that has absolutely nothing to do with you, um, but is in our minds around here, um, in the de minimis part was the maintenance of dams. That's not always going to be de minimis, right? I mean, sometimes. No, no. There's just routine. So we have routine functions based grass, mowing the grass around the upper banks. Uh, but any work on the dam would probably 
uh, fall out of the de minimis. Okay. Scroll. Okay. I, I assumed that so, was yeah. just nice to hear from you. <laughs> okay. Um, the other one was um, the slope stabilization item 44, the riprap and shotcrete, et cetera. I know this is very site specific and it's within the category that says existing stuff, you know, existing structures, existing mm -hmm. work and so forth. Um, but, but one of the concepts that um, comes up a lot in, in our life over here on Kauai is um, what we used to think was the, was the best practice or was the thing to do might not be the best practice continuing. So right. I just want to say out loud, you know, sometimes, you know, just because we did it that way before might not mean that it's the best way to do it, you know, this time. And I know you have room for that, um, but I just needed to say that out loud to you. Right. Understood. And, there, you know, we, we talk about it in some of our projects where when something might have been built originally, there might not have been anything near it. But you yeah. know, with the way the island expanded now, there you know there could be visual impacts to what our newly found, you know, newly established neighbors and you know surrounding entities, but in an area that might have been basically remote at the time of construction. So right, right, that happens to everyone. Thank you so much, Dominic. I just needed to to express that. Appreciate it. Okay. Uh, yeah. Thank you, Makala. Uh, good comments. Is there uh, there are there any further comments on this? If not, um, the motion is in order. Robin, you will. You want to just say it? Um, sure. Um, I move that we ref recommend this exemption list to the full council for its concurrence. Is that correct, Onona? Yep, and I'll second. Okay, great. And I'll just add the friendly amendment with uh, a, a few little changes that Onona noticed, very minor. That okay? Yep. Okay, well, any, any discussion on that? Okay, all in favor? Raise your hand, please. And everybody, Makala, you are up. Thank you. I got to scroll my screen to see all you guys. Thanks. Okay. Uh, well, that's it. That concludes our business for today. And we can get ready for our uh, strategic planning meeting coming up in a little over a half hour. Dominic, thanks very much for showing up. Thank you. At 11 o'clock, we'll reconvene for the full council and we'll. Uh, We'll take this item up uh, pretty much right away, right, Onana? Yeah, we'll, we'll take this up first before we get into strategic planning. So, um, you know, we expect it to be quick like this. You know, we'll make our recommendation to the council. If they have any questions for you, they can go ahead and, and do that or if they have any additional amendments. But yeah, we'll okay. probably take it up right after we five minutes. Um, Dominic, I have a totally irrelevant question. How many employees does uh, Board of Water Supply have about? Oh boy. Um, <laughs> in terms of positions, the last the last time I really got into any kind of programming uh, organizationally, I think we were at seven hundred and something positions. But at that time, we also had several hundred vacancies, so I think we were lingering around the five to six hundred uh, position mark. Uh, we have added, you know, a couple of positions here and there throughout departments, but we've also recently lost a lot of people to retirement, right? About the, I think COVID had a major effect on determinations of uh, people's choice to retire. So I, I, I would imagine we're probably still lingering in that five to 600 uh, employee count. I could probably get a better feel of just and send no, that I, off to you just for your information. No, 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 no. I, I just was trying to get a sense of scale and that's very helpful. Thank you very much. Yeah. All right, guys, I'm gonna, uh, with that, I think I'm gonna go ahead and wrap up this meeting. Uh, Les, you think, uh, are we gonna be, a, you, we're gonna be able to do the full council meeting? Uh, yeah, I believe, I believe we've done so. Riley just found what the problem was, so we'll, we'll be okay. Okay, great. Great. Um, 
Yeah, thanks everybody. And uh, see you in a bit. Meeting is adjourned. Quick, quick, quick question, Russ. So on sure, the formal Tom. submittal of the, that final edit and the formal, do you want a like cover letter type formal submittal to it, the department? It wouldn't or? hurt, it wouldn't hurt okay. to have a cover letter to the, to the uh, chair of the environmental council to Onona and just say pursuant to action at your April 5th meeting, uh, here you go. And you can do that, you know, tomorrow or whatever. You can do it today or right. tomorrow after, after sure. the meeting. Yeah. And then we'll have everything in, in the file. So right. like Onana said, if anybody wants to know who, what, when, where, it'll all be there. Sounds good. Okay. Thanks a lot. All right. Thank you. Thanks, all right, everybody. Yeah. Bye-bye.